Good morning and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we're going to be working in the book. So I found this fabric and I know that you normally do like magazine clippings or whatever in glue books. But as you guys have probably figured out by now, I don't really have a lot of magazine clippings. And if I do, they're kind of all the same thing uh, because I pulled them all out of three magazines. But we're going to be playing with them nonetheless. They are. Don't mind that. Right here. So um, that was. Oi. A die cut. Oh, go up there. Okay, so uh, I also have other stuff in here too that's not magazine stuff. Um, so that's good. Anyway, I want to play with this. So, oh, and I didn't actually do any more of the glue book. I know the last time that we um, we did the glue book, I was like, yeah, I'm going to work on it all my life. Yeah, I didn't actually do that. Um, did something different instead. So, y'all didn't miss anything. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this bad boy in here real quick, like, because I like it, and we're just going to lay it down. I'm going to use fabric tack because, well, it's fabric. And I'm just going to put this all over this page. And I got this nifty little card <laughs> in junk mail today. Well, I didn't get it. Wayne got it. But I stole it because I was like, ooh, that's a really nice card. Because you know how, like, some people use, like, uh, old credit cards or something like that? Yeah. Um, I didn't want to do that. So, I am using this, like, weird, funky, whatever card it is that they gave us in the mail. In the mailbox. Because I still want it, like, all over the place. I just... You can't really use a brush with Fabri-Tac. You can use a uh, like a silicone um, scraper -y thing. That works. I've used that in the past. There we go. And then take this. We're going to put this right over there. Like that. Oh, pretty. And now we have a nice textural page in our glue book as well. Because uh, I am all about breaking rules. I don't think there's really rules with glue books, though. I mean, I really don't. I mean, I think that originally people started using magazines because, like, normal people, not me, <laughs> have magazines, like, in the abundance. I don't, actually. We've never really been big on magazines. The only magazines that I have are National Geographic, and I don't want to tear those up because I actually pay for those. <laughs> Well, then again, I pay for my other magazines that I got uh, at the grocery store as well. <laughs> those were $20. I didn't really want to tear those up either, but <laughs> they were all I had. So I did. But I know that a lot of people have, like, resources to getting magazines fairly inexpensively. Um, I just didn't want to have, like, more paper <laughs> in my house. And I figured, um, I don't think spreading this out really did any justice to this. Because I'm just having to put the glue all back over, over it again. So I'm just going to leave it this time. Anyway, um, and we can add more stuff to that. But there's this really pretty card, actually. It's a vintage postcard and it's really pretty. Can I just like put him like right in the middle of the page and just call it a day? Cause that's really pretty. But I kind of want to put it like, I don't want to do that. Um, What 
what if we did it like that? That's pretty cool. And that way it's not really stuck in there. But it's... I should have filled this up before I turned my camera on. All right. So these are postcards, actually. Um, I'm just going to set this over here because I want it to go over on this page up underneath here. But I want it to be like a loose thing. Um, oh, forever. Okay, so we're just going to kind of leave that be for a moment. And, ooh, let's put you here and then make it a pocket. And a flip at the same time. And then we can put stuff underneath there. But I guess we're not really supposed to be doing that, are we? We're just supposed to be making glue. Like, just glue it down. This is not an album. Or a junk journal. Stop making it into a junk journal. I know. I'm sorry. I forgot. Just glue stuff down. Stop thinking about it. It's the whole point of this, right? Is to just have fun. Get textures that make you feel good. Get pictures that make you feel good. And Santa. Santa makes me smile. So I like Santa. Wishing you a jolly holiday. And this is just a little Dollar Tree card. Um, uh, what did I use? The, I use these for a lot of things, actually, because I send out... Um, I send out mass holiday cards. I'm pretty sure I sent out like three or four hundred this year. Um, and this is the first year, to be honest with you, that I decided to do it. But um, yeah, I sent out like three or four hundred so far. I'm not sending any more out now. Uh, you are seeing this on what is this? The ninth, twentieth. Yeah, it's not the ninth. You were not seeing this on the 19th because uh, I'm hoping, I'm hoping to do another Trash to Treasure on the 19th. Um, that way we can get that guy done. I really like this, this color. I like the color of this. You guys ever keep like junk mail because you like what it looks like? I actually kept something today because I liked the structure of it. It was the um it was the envelope actually that came with that card. Um hold on and I'll show you. Cuz it was just like a regular manila envelope, but it opened weird. Where where are you? You are. It opened at the top. So I figured I could keep this and do something with it. Because, well, that's what I do. I change stuff into pretty stuff and, you know, all that jazz. Oh, well, that's something. Uh, I've lost my glue stick. I don't know what happened to my glue stick. It is gone. Um... No idea where it went. I have some, ooh, stamps. I have some uh, doilies over here that I'm just throwing around. Don't mind me. Some lace. I have started bringing out the, the oh, I found my glue stick. I have started bringing out the, um, the spring and Easter stuff because as a shop owner, I need to have that stuff like, out and ready to go before spring and Valentine's and all that hits. So I'm hoping I have some cards ready, like Valentine's cards specifically, very soon. But it is on the back burner right now because I have a lot. Oh my gosh, I have so much stuff. I really like this color. 
Um, I have so much stuff on my to-do list. It's insane. Can I just like glue you right there? Oh, I love this glue stick. It's awesome. I should probably grab a piece of parchment though, huh? Because I just glued the the snot out of that page. My daughter's making vegetable soup for dinner. Um, I think she's putting that on right now. It's only a little after three. Nope, I lied. It's a little after four. Um, but we have an Instapot, so she, she's going to make it in there. So, uh, I don't know if you guys know this, but Instapots, they're amazing. And you can, like, cook a feast in an hour. It's kind of cool. Yeah, I'm supposed to be making bottles right now. <laughs> uh, I haven't done that yet. Uh, I'm also supposed to be making bottle toppers. <laughs> I haven't done that either. <laughs> I've been trying to get a little ahead on my videos so I can do that stuff. Because I have pre-orders right now for the bottles as well as the toppers. Um, but... I am not entirely sure uh, when I will get all of that done. But hopefully, like a, hopefully it won't be too bad. And this is just a napkin that I found. And I figured, oh, why not? It's pretty. It's festive. You can still see the colors through that through the thing thing. And I just honestly found a whole bunch of stuff in all over my room and just started throwing stuff in that uh folder thing, my bob. Think. Alright, so that's you. That's you. Let's put something here so we can keep it from falling out. Do we have anything that's like thicker? Let's see. Oi. My back is fried. I'm pretty sure I've destroyed it. I'm not really sure what I did, but it is not happy with me. There we go. That'll work because that way it's not going to fall out like that. We could also do two in front, but I like the, the farmhouse, or the farm, the Christmas tree farm. I had to see which, uh, which sides I was going to be gluing here. All right, and then you go there, and there. That way you're not going to fall out. All right. Sit tight. I really like this fabric. This was also a gift. We'll just make this the fabric page. Can we do that? I guess it's our blue book. We can do whatever we want. Ooh, pretty. You are pretty. Um, Let's go. I really want to use all of this. So, let's do, um, hmm, I'm trying to think on, oh, I know, we can use this. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. 
That might be an idea. Okay. Okay. No, oh, oof, off the way. And I'm just kind of gluing in a circle here. You know, I, I have a real hard time with this whole don't think about it thing, which is really ironic if you really think about it, because uh, I do that every single day. I don't really think about things. I just do it. But for whatever reason, the thing that you're not supposed to be thinking about, I'm like, let's think about this. Isn't that ironic? Yeah, I thought that was ironic too. All right. Okay. No, come back. Ooh, we could do it that way. Mm, mm, mm. I want to pull this off the edge just a little bit. All right. Come here. Come here, you. Oi. Oi. Okay. Anybody ever just want to sing? Think. Wow, I am really surprised I have not like canceled y'all's video like a few hundred times because I've hit my mouse like a bunch. All right, and then add this guy. Move my mouse out of the way. So maybe I will stop hitting it on stuff. Wait. Oh, so what kind of shows are you guys watching? I am curious. Not that I really have a lot of time to watch shows, but occasionally I'm just like, you know what? I'm going to take the day off. And I just sit there and watch TV shows. Anybody do that? I do. So I'm just like, I want the day off. And I need a new pair of scissors. These scissors, I tried to cut this fabric uh before I got on on the on the video. And it oh my gosh, these scissors are terrible. I don't know what happened, but they just got so dull so quick. And I mean, I can't say that I'm too terribly surprised because I have had these scissors for a minute. Oh, and you know what? I am such a ding dong. I got this card from Happy Mail and I wanted to show you guys the Happy Mail before we got out of this video um, because I got another Happy Mail and I really wanted to show you guys. So I'm gonna lay this fabric down here. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty and very fitting. Oh my gosh, I love this. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, so I'm gonna lay this part down first. I love this fabric. This is some fabric that my friend Janet sent over from the UK. I am super excited. I love getting stuff from other countries. And I think I like getting stuff from other countries just as much as they like getting stuff from here. Because I have another friend of mine who's in Switzerland. She's like, Mirka! <laughs> her and her husband both are very funny. Um, but they also really enjoy getting stuff that is American. And I think it's just kind of that you like what isn't readily available, you know, type of thing. All right, so this video is going to go a little over 20 minutes because, like I said, I do want to show you that happy email. I haven't even opened it yet. Um, she probably expected it yesterday, um, but I forgot because I filmed yesterday's and today's at the same time. 
So I'm going to make sure that it's in today's video. Because I want to open it. I'm super excited. All right. So there's that. That can dry. Now let's hope that happy mail. All right. Yay. Okay. So we actually got a couple pages done today. We got this one done here. And then we've got this one here with a postcard, a vintage postcard. Also has the fabric. I'm pretty sure those came from the same spot. Um, and uh, a greeting card from Miss D. Yes, this one will still add a little bit more to this because there's a little bit here on the bottom that I want to cover up. But other than that, I love the different textures on this page. Anyway, so we're going to close this up. We're going to leave this here because of the glue. So we're going to throw that over there. Throw this over here. And by throw, I do not mean literally. Toss, maybe. You know. Not throw. Okay, so a couple things. Uh, this one and this one. This one's I uh, definitely want to get into that. This is a Etsy share real quick, and I will show you guys, or I will link this in the description, but a lot of people have asked me, where do you get your hearts? And that's probably why my scissors are so um, dull, because I open anything and everything with my scissors. Ooh, that needs to go in my blue book thingy. Okay, so this is from Potted Hearts, and um, thank you. Aw. Thank you. I love this shop. Um, I got these to go into um, my Christmas um, ephemera, embellishment, stuff like that. And they're just, they're quilted pieces, but they're all Christmas related. So I thought those were super duper cute. And then these are the Christmas bits. Oh, wait, this is what I ordered. This was the freebie. <laughs> Oops. It'll make sense here in a second. And I'll, like I said, I will leave the, um, the thingy in the description box for you guys. Cause a lot of people ask me where I get my padded hearts and, um, it's from the padded heart company on Etsy. See, aren't they adorable? I love these things. I love all of the quilted pieces. Oh, and look at this color. That's a pretty color. red velvet cookies. I love this. These are awesome. And then this one here is the bigger pieces. Do you imagine like putting a little word right there? Super cute. I love this. The cookie exchange. Measure stir, mix, measure stir. <laughs> I like that one. Oh, I like this one. All hearts come home for Christmas. That would be really cute on a spine of a journal. It'd be really cute. Like going up and down. Yes. All right. So my, actually my basket for her is underneath my um, desk right here. So I'm going to take this whole thing and put it right in her basket. Well, my basket, but you know what I mean? I hope. Um, okay, so the Happy Mail that I wanted to show you guys, um, that's my receipt. Yeah, let me double check and see. Yeah, I just got the one thing. So everything that came in this bag was completely extra. All right, um, and her shop is on vacation right now. Um, so I will double check. I make sure, but I'll leave her link anyway. That way you can favorite the shop and you can um, just keep checking back. But the last time I checked, it was on vacation. That was a couple days ago, though. So, Ooh. oh, I know what this is. Oh, wow. Okay, so this is for Miss Erica. And um, I like this. I'm weird. I'm a texture person. I love the sound of that. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at that. 
Did you sign it? Oh. You did sign it! Good! <laughs> I was like, no! But she did. This is a handmade card. Oh, and it's a Xander! Thank you! I love it! Oh, and she gave me an Xander! Yay! I love these. Thank you so much. Okay, so uh, I can definitely put this in my glue book. Absolutely. Um, because I can glue, because she didn't write anything on the back back of it, I can just glue it straight down. Okay, you're not cooperating with me. <gasps> That's funny. What happens under the mistletoe stays under the mistletoe. That's so funny. <gasps> I love this lace. Gosh. Is it bad that that's, that's what I noticed? The lace. Oh my gosh. Okay. Uh, I'm going to take this out this way so I don't keep knotting that up because I'm just knotting it up. Um, and I will untangle that. And this is vintage music paper. I love music. Um... I have some, but I don't have vintage. This is really amazing. Oh, I lied. I have a single book that's vintage, but I'm really contemplating on whether or not I want to tear it up because I paid a lot for it. Well, for me, it was a lot. It was like $40. But it is in German. This is pretty. I love this. And it smells old, too. <laughs> Am I the only fool that does that? Oh my god, I love the smell of old paper. <gasps> They're magazines! I don't have magazines! Yee. Yay! Oh, I love this. Oh, look at... Oh, look, I like fussy cutting like that. You can just cut out the square. That's awesome. Ooh, look, and there's more. Oh, that is so cool. See... That's what I want to try to be able to do is I can fussy cut a little bit better now because I've got the, the springy scissors, but I still can't sit there for hours and hours and hours and hours and hours fussy cutting. Like I just, I can't do it. Um, but for the little bit of time I can't fussy cut, it'd be nice to, you know, sit down, chillax and watch a TV show that you guys recommend and, and, and. Oh, these are really cool. I actually really like this. Is that bad? I like this. I like the envelope too. Ooh, that's fun. Oh, I love this. Birds and blooms. Extra. That is a pretty bird. Where? Oh, that's got an address on it. I don't know where you got that. Uh, let me flip it over. There we go. I'm just double checking. Oh, that one's. Yeah, that one's got an address on it too. Okay. So, that is a pretty bird. That is also a pretty bird. That's not a pretty bird. It's a nice pair of shoes, though. Pretty bird. You know, it's funny as we had. Well, I say we. I never owned the bird. It was my mom. Uh, or was it my mom or Benita? I don't remember if it was my mom or my stepmom because they both had birds. Um, oh, that's pretty. Anyway, one of them would say pretty bird and it would make the, the bird go crazy. She'd start talking and whatnot. Well, not talking, but chirping or whatever. This is nice. I like the... Oh. I like the in-flight birds. I like the texture of this paper. I don't know what those are, but that's nice. Oh, it's a butterflies! I like butterflies, too. Just in case y'all didn't figure that out. Alright, so then there's this one here. This one is called House Beautiful. I like that sink. That's a nice sink. I'm 
I'm not sure that my wardrobe, closet, dresser area is ever that organized. Boop. Oh, that's pretty. I like that. Oh, that's nice, too. I like that nice, bright, open area. I like how it's got all kinds of different words as well, because that's something else I'm learning with the whole glue book thing, is to cut out words. Live better awards. Those are like three very separate words that can be. Too beautiful. Go from bare to beautiful. Stay calm, stay connected, stay active. Alone, together. It's very dramatic. Oh, that's pretty. I like these. Thank you so much, Miss Erica. These are awesome. These are so cool. Oh my God, I love it. That's awesome. Okay, okay, so uh, now we're pushing. Oh, we're over 30 minutes. Okay, good job. Okay, so anyway, like I said, I really wanted to get this in for you guys um, because I was excited and I was like, ah, to see it. And I forgot to record it in the video that I aired yesterday. So um, anyway, so this is going to air Sunday. So um, thank you so, so much. You guys have a wonderful day. I hope you're enjoying the glue book. I'm having fun with the glue book, even though I'm probably not doing it right. But it's a lot of fun to play with. Anyway, you guys have a wonderful day, and I will catch you all in the next video. Bye, guys.